Hey there, welcome to another episode of Hangout with me in my kitchen space. In today's episode, let's make some boozy dry fry and for me, I have my list of ingredients. I have my cubed boozy meat and I also have some black pepper. For the veggies, I have some tomatoes, onions, capsicum, ginger and garlic. I also have some Rico powder and some Rico cubes. I have some salt, some cooking oil and some soy sauce. And without further ado, let's get started. So once my spray is hot enough, I'll go in with about one and a half tablespoons of cooking oil. Then once that is also hot, I'll go in with my ginger. Then, once my ginger is pregnant, I'll go in with my meat. Then I'm going to sprinkle my black pepper and just a small pinch of salt because we are going to be using some spices that contain salt so you do not want to overdo the salt bit. Then I'll cover this for a couple of minutes. About five minutes later you can see that it is still cooking with its own juices because this goat meat was very fresh. At this point, I'm also going to go in with my garlic so that the flavors can also be infused. Three or so minutes later, I'm back. And you can see that it has already dried. And also remember, goat meat doesn't take long to cook. So at this point, I'm going to add my capsicum. Then I'm going to add in my onions. So you can have it as it is, just like this. It's very delicious. Mountain coffee. Then um this has been cooking for about two minutes or so. So I'm going to add my tomatoes. And I'm going to add in my cubes. Then I'm going to let the tomatoes do their thing for about two or so minutes. Look at this beauty. So 
so at this point our milk is ready but i do not like this pale color especially when cooking it so i'll go in with a few drops of soy sauce and you can add as much or as little as you may prefer So that's better. Then I'm going to taste if I need to adjust any salt. Mm. Mm. Wow. This is just perfect. So remember we had some um, rico powder. I mixed it with some water and I'm going to add it at this point. Then that's going to help the gravy ishikane. So I'm going to cook this uncovered for about two or so minutes till it becomes a really nice dry dry. Now that this is dry to my liking, I'll top it up with some coriander leaves. And just like that, this is ready to be enjoyed with some ugali. So I'll switch that off, then I'll see you for serving and tasting. And as you've seen, it was that easy and I've served my dry fry with some kinyeji and some ugali. And let's dig in. Mm. That tastes beautiful. Mm. Mm -hmm. Such a simple recipe, like in your mm? mm. Ingepatana mm. tuna kova kadu hivi. And as you've seen, this is such an easy recipe. Lakini meja mutamu. That's it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.